nyumbani kwake Karen na wadau mbalimbali wakiwemo magavana na baadhi ya mawaziri kujadiliana kuhusu mikakati ambayo imewekwa ili kukabiliana na athari za mvua ya El Nino. Mvua hiyo inatarajiwa kunyesha nchini kuanzia mwezi huu hadi mwezi wa Januari mwaka 2024 kama ilivyotabiriwa na idara ya utabiri wa hali ya anga nchini Kenya. Huku nchi ikitarajia mvua ya El Nino kuanzia mwezi huu hadi mwezi wa Januari mwaka 2024 kulingana na utabiri wa idara ya hali ya anga nchini wadau mbalimbali wanaendelea kushirikiana na serikali kwa matayarisho ya mvua hiyo. Hii leo naibu rais Rigathi Gashagwa amefanya mkutano nyumbani kwake na wadau mbalimbali kujadili kuhusu mikakati ya kudhibiti athari za mvua ya El Nino. Want to give the government's commitment that we shall apply all resources at our disposal resources at our disposal including the Kenya Defence Forces the Minister for Defence is here the National Youth Service is a reserve army for the country when there are challenges the National Youth Service will be available to help the counties that have cities and towns in cleaning and unclogging the drainage system katika utuba yake naibu rais amesema kuwa lengo la matayarisho hayo ni kuzuia maafa ambayo yanaweza kusababishwa na mvua hiyo na vile vile kuweka mikakati ambayo itahakikisha kuwa mali ya kila mkenya hayaribiwi kama ilivyotendeka mwaka wa 1997. Let us all work together for the common benefit of the people of Kenya. We harmonize our strategies, we reach out, we consult and we pull resources together so that we can be able to deal with the expected challenges that will come with the rains we are here uh, to support uh, all, all the initiatives that uh, uh, any initiatives that uh, we are we have the capacity to and, uh, and as safaricom i can commit uh, that we we are ready uh, to support especially the early warning signs which are uh, early warning Uh, support uh, communication uh, through flash messages and so on Kulingana na naibu rais tayari baadhi ya maeneo nchini yanashuhudia mvua ambayo si ya kiwango cha kawaida huku kaunti zaidi ya 20 zikitarajiwa kuathirika zaidi kutokana na mvua hiyo We ask Kenyans not to be very adventurous because the director general of meteorological department said some people are dare devils and we saw that in 1997 some motorists are impatient they want to drive through raging floods and we lost many lives in 1997 wito umetolewa kwa wakenya walio katika nyanda za chini kuhamia nyanda za juu huku wakulima ambao mimea yao imekomaa wakitakiwa kuvuna na kuhifadhi vizuri au hata kuuza mazao yao ili kuzuia kukadiria hasara Beatrice Kageha Look up TV